All right. Welcome, everyone. My name is Alex Furlan. I'm here today on behalf of the Onerese project team here in Nantes, France. And I'm here today with our second weekly update video. This time around, I'm going to be talking a little bit about our project overview. So to jump right into it, I'd like to say, what is our project? What is it about? Our project is a high accuracy, ultra low cost temperature array. Now we want to have an array of temperature sensors and a data logging device to record the temperatures coming in. We want this to be compact enough to fit inside commercial ovens. We want it to have high accuracy, ideally within one degree Celsius. And we want to have ultra low cost. Again, we're, this time we're shooting for under $1,000. The major components of this system are the low-cost array as well as a controller, that will be referred to as an LCA, as well as a low-cost thermal barrier to protect the system, this is the LCB. So just to take a step back, I want to talk about why we're doing this project. Uh, Onerese, the school we are partnered with, is a school of veterinary science and food sciences. And Onerese currently uses a commercially available solution to test and calibrate their ovens, very similar to the system that we're developing. Uh, the system they're using is quite expensive, however, it's around $8,000 US, and Onerese is interested in finding a more affordable solution, and we believe that we can provide a similar system at a greatly reduced cost. So our goals for this year are threefold. Our first goal is to have a fabrication and testing laboratory here in Nantes for three main reasons. The first reason is so that we have a convenient location for development and testing of this product. Secondly, we want to have a good location for education based around microcontrollers and control systems, specifically the Quanzer system. And lastly, we want to have a laboratory for teaching Junior Mechies basic lab instrumentation. Uh, for many of them, this is their first time using an oscilloscope or a power supply or a function generator. So we want to have a good base of knowledge for them to learn and use going forward. Uh, our second goal is to have a fully functioning LCA and to have it be accurate within one degree Celsius. This has been a point of consternation for previous year's teams. Uh, if I recall correctly, last year's team would have error between two and five degrees Celsius on each given thermocouple sensor. Uh, but this year, we hope to have that error reduced down to below one degree Celsius. And lastly, we would like to have a fully implemented LCB by the time we're done here. Uh, again, last year, uh, never really got around to that. They have a number of crude prototypes, but nothing close to a finished prototype. And we hope to have one of those by the time we are finished here. Um, this week marks the end of our housekeeping projects at the moment, um, and from here on forward we're going to be spending a lot of time working on the project itself. So I hope to have a lot of news for you come next week. Thank you very much for your time.